What's going on guys? Welcome back to Fort Knox. In this video, we'll be going over some ways you guys can copy bases in Clash of Clans. I know a lot of new players don't know how to do this and we'll just go over three main ways that you guys can go ahead and copy a base so you don't have to come up with your own concepts for your bases. You can actually find other people's bases and copy them. But before that, if you don't mind, smash that like button and consider subscribing if you like Clash of Clans content. If you guys want to learn some new attack strategies, how to get some gold Old loot and all that stuff that's what this channel is all about so if you do like that please consider subscribing and turning on that notification bell so for the first way to copy someone's base it's kind of simple obviously you can go ahead and manually copy it so you can go ahead and go into your layout and then have a picture of the base and actually copy exactly uh, what the base is doing manually. It's very annoying very tedious and I don't recommend this as well as there's YouTube guides out there that you can watch them make the base you can like drag and drop and take forever to find a base. This is the way that a lot of new players think they have to do it but there are so many different tools now that you guys can use to copy a base more effectively and that will bring me into the second method to copy a base. So the second method to copy a base is actually using the copy layout button. Yes that button does exist and I'll show you how to use it right now. Now, so pretty much if you guys go into your clan or any of your friends list, you guys can actually go and click and visit their base. And when you do so in the top right hand corner, there'll be a copy layout button. Be careful though, not to use this on a base that isn't in the same town hall as you because they will not have a layout that will be good for your town hall level. You'll either have too much or too little to copy. So you want to make sure you're in the same town hall level so you are copying a base that will actually work for the amount of wizard towers you have or the amount of bombs you have or the amount of walls. If you copy too high, you'll be missing a big line of walls and it will look bad. And if you copy too low, you'll have to kind of figure out where you're going to put all these extra pieces. So just keep that in mind when you're using this copy button. Of course, you always have three slots you can use for both your home village, your war base, and your builder base. All three of these bases all will allow you to have three layouts. And you can do this for all three of these layouts. You can go to your uh, teammates war base and copy their war base as well. So that's super, super effective. And the third and final way that I know to copy a base in Clash of Clans, and it's my favorite way to copy a base in Clash of Clans is by using links. So you can actually go on Clash of Clans, scroll through, go to Google and like type in like Clash of Clans Town Hall 11 base link and it'll bring up a website. I'll leave a link in the description box below to one of the websites that I've used. I don't know how trustworthy it is, but I've used it for years and I've had no problems. So I don't mind using it. And pretty much it'll have like a list of farming bases, uh, war bases, all different types of bases that will suit your needs and multiple choices for each type of base, whether it's like an engineering type base, depends on what your goals are, but they have one to suit everyone's needs for every single town hall level. So that's really efficient for those new players that don't know exactly what they're doing but they have an idea of what their goal is they can find a base that will suit their needs and when you find that base you can either click the picture in most cases but if not there'll be a link above or below the picture of the base you click it and it will boot up clash of clans automatically and bring you to that copy layout screen and you'll be able to copy or import the base on one of your three slots and you will be able to have that nice customized base in a few clicks without having to manually copy or use a friend's base you can be completely unique and to have something customized to your goals without having to uh, put in all the work. So hopefully this video helps you guys understand how you can go about and copy bases without having to manually enter them like I first mentioned. Again, if you find videos like this helpful, please do subscribe and drop a like on this video and share it with your friends that may be new to Clash of Clans. They might benefit from information like this. And as always, thank you guys so much for watching.